Okay. This is how I'm going to... Uh, I changed the pickup. I, I put a, a Gibson pickup in the back of my uh, Epiphone dot. And to change pickups on these types of guitars is a real pain because you really can't get you really can't get at underneath you have to take well, what I had to do what I thought I had to do or what I think I have to do is you have to take all the controls out to get at where the wires from the pickups go so what I did was I undid the screws and all that dropped them down in there and then pulled them out through the hole and I soldered the back pickup wiring. And this is how I'm getting all the controls back underneath and up through the hole on the underside. And on top, when you do that, you have to put the star washer. The star washer has to go on first. And then it has to come up through the wood. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so this is how I get these controls back from the underside because there's not much room to stick your fingers on the, in the F holes, right? So this is what I do. Okay, I, I gotta get the star washer on there. All right. Focus this thing. This freaking camera's a pain in the ass. Right. Now, we'll put the star washer on now. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to stop this and set the camera on a tripod to hold it so I can use two fingers. Okay. So what I'm going to take here, I got a wire. Okay, it's just a, it, it's a, it was a wire that came off an old set of cheap headphones for the, uh, for my cell phone. So it's got the, the, regular wires here this would be the ground and this is the hot sand they insulate the center now on the pot there's a slot so what I do is I take the wire the ground wire and I slide it down see there and you just you slide it down in between the slot like that till it stops at the bottom then you take and you wrap that wire around and then I take the hot wire and I slide that down in there also like that and wrap that around so now I got something to tug so you see what I'm going to do now I'm going to pull the pot up from the underside through the hole and I'll take the wire this up through now I don't want to I don't want to pull on it too hard because you might pull the wires back off the pot so what I do is I have a piece of rod here that I'm going to go down inside the guitar with it going inside the guitar and kind of push the pot along towards the hole and then just take up the slack with the wire. And there it is. Okay? Now you put your finger against the side the side of the pot to hold it, keep from backing down, falling back inside. And you take the wire off and you hold it. And now stick your finger in there and you take the flat washer, put that over it. Take your finger out of the way, let it drop down against the body of the guitar, hold it again. Now we get now we get the nut. Drop it over the top. Put it down. And get it started. And there it is. And now all I gotta do is get the wrench and tighten them up and the pots are in. And that's, that's how I got them in the FO. And you can see it didn't take long at all. Otherwise, if you didn't have some kind of method to 
to pull them up, up to line, you know, bring them inside and then bring them towards the holes. God, you could, you could be there all day long. But anyways, that's what I did. Cool.